Shalom. First and foremost, I'd like to give all praises and glory and honor to Shalom to the uh, elders, Wa'at and Wa'akwa. Peace and blessings to you and yours and your families as well, too. In the names of Yahweh, Shalom, 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 And once again, Shalom to the uh, elders, Wa'at and Wa'akwa. And the Heavenly Father's true name is Ayahawa, and is on the other side, Ba'ashem, in the name of Ma'ashiach, Ka'ashiach, those are the true names in the ancient Hebrew Hebrew, the last one can ask the tongue, and I say Shalom. And this is another quick sit-down lesson that I want to bring out of uh, Isaiah 33, verse 6. And this is the book of Isaiah, chapter 33, verse 6, which is the prophet Isaiah, our great forefather. This is the prophet Isaiah, chapter 33, verse 6, and it reads to the Holy Scriptures. And wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of our times and the strength of salvation and the fear of the Lord and how is his treasure. Right, so wisdom and knowledge definitely shall be the stability of our times and the strength of salvation and the fear of the Lord is his treasure. Because like the scripture says, uh, the beginning of wisdom is uh, fearing Yahweh, which is the Heavenly Father Yahweh. Because you look at the definition of stability. The definition of stability is a noun. It says the state of being stable. There are prayers of political stability in the area. And the similar words to stability, which is a noun, firmness, solidarity, steadiness, I mean steadiness, solidarity, secureness, fastness, stoutness, studiousness, security, safety, balance, balance of mind, mental health, soundness, rationally, reason. Sense. Uh, so, solidarity, strength, durability, endurance, nature, immense, reliability, dependability. So, definitely, you know, having a sound mind, a static, uh, having a sound mind, a stable mind, because wisdom and knowledge definitely should be the stability of our times, and especially the current times that we're in, and especially the times that we're about to enter into. Just like it says in the book of Daniel, uh, the 12th chapter, a hey, knowledge should increase and many should run to and fro. So, wisdom and knowledge definitely should be just the ability of our times and the strength of salvation, the ability of the strength of our salvation, and the fear of the Lord, Yahweh is his treasure. You know? So, wisdom and knowledge definitely should be just the ability of our times and the strength of salvation, and the fear of the Lord, Yahweh is his treasure. Because, uh, the precepts I get understanding of uh, blessed he that readeth, you know. So, hey, when I verse the third chapter, it says, Acknowledge him and he shall direct thy path, especially through this wisdom and knowledge and understanding from the heavenly father, Yahweh himself, you know. So, with that, you know, this was just a quick sit down lesson of uh, Isaiah 33 and verse 6. And so, with that, I'm going to give all praises and glory to God, too. Shalom to your elders, my aunt, 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 my aunt,